My mentor, Peter Sage, gave a really good description of this, Neil. He said yeah. that look at challenges as the wrapping paper to a gift that is yet to present itself. Oh, wow. And, and, I, really like, and I really like the way he explained uh, he, he that. But, um, you'll probably find me quoting Peter quite a lot in this podcast. So, oh, that's all <laughs> right. Know, yeah, yeah. No, so- you know, I'm, a guy does, I'm a guy that does a lot of mentoring, but I also have mentors myself and uh, – and um, it's a, a lot of the teachings of my mentors that um, have become the pastiche of what I am today. So, yeah. So what, what's your thoughts on uh, mentorship? How important is it for people? Well, it certainly was huge in my development and still today continues to be mm. uh, a very important part of, of, of life. Um, you know, the reason I do what I do today is because – as a youngster who started out in music, I was fortunate enough to come across wonderful people who mentored me. They, they didn't know me. They, they owed me nothing. I was just a kid. Mm. And yet they were prepared to take me under their wing and show me stuff about the business and life. And um, and it always remained with me. And, and so I remember I'm, I made a promise to myself as a 19-year-old that if I ever got to a point where I created my own studio and I – became, you know, fully, you know, a full-time master engineer and, and sort of reached the kind of point where these guys are at, that I would I would pay it forward, I'd do the same because I felt that was a big part of what made these people so great. Not not just the fact that they were technically brilliant and they had these great discographies, but they were they were really amazing, humble, very giving people. And uh, and, and I, it, it was never lost on me. Oh, well, you got a really big heart there. Oh, well, man, you know, I think we all do. Uh, everyone's got a big heart, and I uh, thank you. I appreciate that. Yes, I mm. do. Um, but I I think that we all do, uh, and it's just a matter of uh, getting access to that, connecting to that. You know, when, when you can really connect to that part of you, um, then, then, then you're able to be more loving, more giving, more compassionate, more of a contributor to the world, um, et cetera, et cetera. But, you know, mentoring is a really interesting topic because I think it's – don't about misunderstood, but it, it's such a broad – it covers such a broad range. Um, m- mentoring is – I think people maybe see mentoring as someone who's with you all the time, constantly, and, and, and that certainly is mentoring. And But, you know, I, I, I mentor a lot of people, and some of the people who I would categorize as – let's just call them my mentees for lack of a better word, mm. you know, people that might you call up. In, in the same way, I, people that I mentor, I'm, I'm not – speaking to them on a week-to-week basis. It could be two, three times a year. Something comes up for me, I'm not entirely sure about it, or I just want to get some clarification or whatnot. And and so, you know, it can be someone that and, – and look, mentors don't even have to be people that you know. Mm. That, 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 you know, I mean, for example, again, Peter Sage coming in again. One of his mentors, he puts down, um, he puts down Yoda from Star Wars. Oh, wow. Right? Yeah. Now, now he's a fictional character that mm. you're never going to meet, but again, he's he has a certain wisdom. He there are certain things that he would say that uh, you know that are profound and are true, mm. you know. And so, and, and so as a result, you know, I can understand how um, you know he he would say that. And 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 so for anyone who's watching and listening, you, you don't have to have someone. You don't even have to pay someone. Um, on a week to week or month to month, you know, you, you can seek people online, people that you admire, that you respect, that you you you, you see qualities in them that you would like, either you would like to have. And if, and I'll tell you now, if you do see that in other people, trust me, you've got them within you. Otherwise, you wouldn't be able to identify with them. Um, and 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 just follow what um, you know. And and the other thing too, I'd say about mentoring is that um, while you would respect your mentors and what they have to say. Always test drive everything for yourself. Don't yeah. just take a carte blanche. You know, just because something works for someone doesn't mean it'll automatically work for you. Yeah. So don't be afraid to question uh, what you're told, or, or, or test it out for yourself. Mm. You know, um, I, I encourage everyone. You know, I, I, everything I share with you is based on my own subjective experience of reality and what worked for me. It doesn't necessarily mean it's going to work for you in exactly the same way, but. Yeah. You know, I'm going to offer something for consideration uh, for them to go and try should they be uh, so inclined. 